I received this battery as uh, part of the Vine program from Amazon in order to do a review. This fits the Craftsman line of uh, 20 volt drills and other tools. The thing is, when it arrived, it was DOA. So this was just unusable. By the way, I did try the obvious thing, which is to put it on the charger and there were no lights showing and I left it for a few hours and nothing happened. So what I've done in this video is something that you should never do at home unless you uh, are willing to take the risk. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna show you how I was able to fix it. The first thing I wanted to do with this was to open it up and find out if there were any obvious broken wires or connectors that were not fastened properly. It looks like there's just four screws right here. First of all, you need to find uh, what is a Torx bit. Okay, this fits. See if we can get these off. And then you've got to hope that there's no booby traps inside of here. So now what happens is we open this. There's something pushing up here. There we go. And there is the internals. We take a look at this. You can see they've got four, eight, 10 cells. Brought it outside because I uh, had experience before taking a rechargeable battery apart and uh, actually it did set on fire. This is supposed to be a 20 volt battery, but I'm gonna try it with a car charger because right now, as I measured before, it's it's only measuring one point something volts. I think it's just too low that the, the regular charger for this does not work. I'm gonna, I'm gonna plug this in and see what kind of modes we've got. So we've got three modes there. I'm gonna try it on that one. Got that terminal right there. And this circuit board, I disconnected this. I think that says error. Okay, well, let's see if it goes in another mode. Oh, charge. It says charge. Oh, 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 oh. Power, charge. And it says 12.8 volts, so it's trying to charge it. So I'm gonna let that sit for a while and come back and see if this will actually take a charge. I just left this for maybe uh, five minutes or so. This is flashing on the camera because of the uh, the strobe effect, but it's actually, it says full. I'm gonna take this off. I'll check the voltage. So take a look at this. What we've got here is, I didn't disconnect this yet. It just says full over here. And I'm putting this on the positive. I've got my voltmeter set here and it says 13.76 volts. 13.75, that's amazing. So what I'm gonna do is put this back in its case and we'll put it on the, the regular power tool charger. So I'm gonna carefully put this back, I'm gonna attach the circuit board again and put that push back in there nice and firmly. This is the indicator of the battery strength. So. Interestingly, it's got, I don't know what that flashing light means. Perhaps that means that it has a low charge, which is correct because this is supposed to be uh, a 20 volt battery. This was not difficult to take apart. It's, there's the button. And the only other thing is this, uh, this clamp. And I'm just going to figure out where that goes. That goes, looks like that goes like that. And looks like there's a place there for the spring. So this looks pretty straightforward. Now I did forget to put that screw back in there. So I just have to put these screws back and we're done. It's nice to have a power tool. This is the moment of truth. I've got the, I've got the charger right here. It's gonna work. Well, look at that. That means it's charging. When I first tried this, there was, there was absolutely no light on here. So I'm gonna leave that. I'm getting a little bit impatient with this. It seems to be taking a long time. Um, it's not, I don't think it's been an hour yet, but you know, I wanna just try it. It feels warm. 
Uh, it might be good to give it a rest too, I don't know. Let's, let's see. Look at that. So it's actually working. Um, push this one. And it's... Oh, look at that. Okay, now it shows two. So it looks like... It's working just fine. Actually, I just noticed something unusual about this. The lights are on the back. Here's an update with the charging situation. Um, I took this off because it was taking a long time. It's been sat there for uh, over an hour, maybe two hours, I'm not sure. But right now it's up to 19 volts, which is a whole lot better than zero. And uh, if you look at this, it's actually showing three bars right now, which I, I didn't realize. And uh, I did find out something else about this light because you actually, if you push this, I think you double click, or you push long push, and then the light comes on. So if this shone light on your situation, please give me the thumbs up if you like this and consider subscribing if you haven't already. And look forward to seeing you again next time.